This video series has been made to study science subject SEE examination grade 10. In this series, we have been solving questions of previous board exams. Now we are going to discuss answers of 2075 SEE examination. And this is the question paper of province number 2. Now we are going to discuss answers of group A. There are 15 questions in total in group A. One mark for each question. So to total 15 marks. Question number 1A. What is the value of acceleration due to gravity G at the center of the earth? The value of acceleration due to gravity or G at the center of the earth is 0. Question number B. What is atmospheric pressure? The weight of air or atmosphere on the bodies and on the surface of the earth is called atmospheric pressure. Pressure exerted by air or atmosphere around us. That is atmospheric pressure. So if it is a standard atmospheric pressure then the answer will be a little bit different. Standard atmospheric pressure is the pressure at the sea level. Atmospheric pressure measured at the sea label which is equal to 760 millimeter of mercury column okay but here our question is simply what is atmospheric pressure so weight of air or atmosphere on the bodies or on the surface of the earth is called atmospheric pressure question number c write any two examples of biofuel biofuel is the uh, fuel made from plants and animals organic origin okay so plants and animals are converted into you know fuel and that is called biofuel two examples of biofuel are firewood uh, which is burnt okay and for cooking food and for doing other work and charcoal charcoal is obtained by burning firewood or dung cakes cow dung buffalo dung these are burnt as a source of fuel these are burnt in kitchen okay to cook food Okay, in villages, these are dung cakes. And question number D, write the relation between heat gain or heat loss by the body with its surface. So, heat gain or heat loss by the body is directly proportional to the surface area. If the surface area is bigger, the heat gained or heat <coughs> lost will be more. And the vice versa, if surface is smaller, then heat gain or heat loss by the body will be less okay more the surface area more the heat gain or more heat loss uh, the magnification in lens is less than one what does it mean question number e magnification uh, of lens is less than one means image is smaller than object the height of the image is smaller than height of the object so from this formula magnification equal to height of the image divided by height of the object okay so from this formula we can understand that if magnification is less than 1, then image is smaller than object. I is value of image is smaller than value of object. So, this is your answer. Now, we are going to see question number F. Question number F is what is acid? What is acid? So, acid is a chemical compound which gives hydrogen ions when dissolving water acids are chemical compounds which give hydrogen ion in aqueous solution or when dissolving water right so this is your answer and they have sour test these compounds have sour test okay now next question is what is an alloy alloy is a mixture of two or more metals uh, which has greater strength or improved quality than the metals used than the metals used to make alloy in order to increase the strength in order to uh, have more shining okay and uh, in order to have improved quality alloys are made okay alloy is made by mixing two or more metals right so this is alloy example brass bronze are examples of alloys Question number H, what is IUPAC name of methyl alcohol? The IUPAC name of methyl alcohol is methanol. Methanol. Okay, question number I, write one special property of water glass. The special property of water glass is it is soluble in water. Okay, it is a glass but it is soluble in water. That is why it is used to make a decoration article. Okay, yes, chemical garden. 
uh, by dissolving in water different colors glasses are dissolved in water and these look like flowers or the plants so that is called chemical garden so uh, the water glass is soluble in water and question number j write the name of non-granular leukocyte the examples of non-granular leukocytes leukocytes are wbc's okay wbc's are lymphocytes and monocytes lymphocytes and monocytes okay leukocytes means wbc's okay now what is kinetochore question number k kinetochore kinetochore is a complex protein present in centromere of dna or chromosome which is a major attachment point for spindle fiber so what happens here is so this is a chromosome uh, chromosome is splits up into two in the process of dna duplication no when dna duplication takes place one single chromosome is splits up into two okay forming two chromatids right so these two chromatids are attached at this point which is called centromere okay so centromere this point has protein complex protein compounds complex protein compounds these protein compounds are kinetochore okay because of kinetochore spindle fibers get attached with this uh, in spindle fiber so spindle fiber is made in this manner in cell division okay so spindle fibers so all the chromosomes get attached with the spindle fiber and this attachment is done with the help of kinetochore present in the centromere <coughs> right so kinetochore is present at the centromere and these kinetochore is a complex protein present in the centromere dna thread or the single chromosome so this is your answer kinetochore now question number question number uh, L question number L name any two plant hormones the name of two plant hormones are auxin and cytokinin <coughs> auxin and cytokinin right uh, auxin and cytokinin are two plant hormones okay these initiate the growth of uh, roots and the stems okay roots stems are grown with the help of these hormones question number m write scientific name of p the scientific name of p is pisum sativum pisum sativum you have to write it this way this should be capital letter p i s u m pisum sativum second letter the first letter should be small okay this is a small only this should not be capital and both of these words should be underlined <coughs> generic name and specific name okay Gen generic name and species name specific name or species name okay generic name species name and both of these words should be underlined in this manner this way we write scientific name and question number n what is environmental pollution very very simple question the uh, mixing of unwanted materials in the natural resources that is environmental pollution right the, uh, the environmental pollution can be defined as the mixing of harmful substances for living things and these are present in air water and soil yes mixing of harmful substances in air water and soil which are harmful for living things right environmental pollution can be defined as the mixing of harmful substances in air water and soil and these are harmful for living things this is the definition simplest definition of environmental pollution no need to use complicated words over here what is crude oil or raw oil crude means raw the crude oil is rock oil or raw petroleum raw petroleum trapped between the rock layers deep inside the earth trapped between the rock layers and these are made from fossils of plants and animals that lived millions of years ago okay the fossil fuel formation deep inside the earth okay the petroleum which is taken out from the earth in the raw condition raw form is called crude oil by refining this crude oil or raw petroleum petrol diesel kerosene uh, paraffins asphalt different kinds of materials are obtained okay after refining only right so in the beginning in natural form it is called rock oil or raw petroleum which is also called crude oil yes trapped between the rock layers made from fossils of plants and animals that lived millions of years ago so with this we finish discussion of group a s e e examination 2075 province number 2